The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to perform a Pearson correlation in SPSS. It's already been demonstrated with the positive correlation observed between years of education completed and annual earnings. This case here is a negative correlation, and I thought it's useful to include that in the book chapter rather than just an example to practice with. I wanted to include it in the foundation section of the textbook because it's important to see both types of correlations. And in this case, the example data are from a study relevant to the distinctiveness of somebody's face and their level of attraction. And to perform the correlation, click on Analyze, Correlate, Bivariate, same exact steps as any other type of Pearson correlation. Include distinctiveness and attractiveness in your variables box. Make sure Pearson's is selected and click OK. And here's the negative correlation that I report in the textbook, negative 0.317, and it's a p equal 0.014. And because that p-value is less than 0 0.050, it is determined to be statistically significant, and the sample size is 60. So that's a correlation that's negative. And actually, to throw in the coefficient of determination, I can do that too. So this time here, 0.317, and I could multiply that by 0.317 and I get 0 0.100. That's the coefficient of determination. Therefore, 10% of the variance in attractiveness was accounted for by distinctiveness.